Hi friends. Welcome to Content Factory. Today I am talking about mobile phone. A mobile phone is a portable telephone that can make and receive calls over a radio frequency link while the user is moving within a telephone service area. The radio. Frequency link establishes a connection to the switching systems of a mobile phone operator, which provides access to the public switched telephone network. Modern mobile telephone services use a cellular network architecture and, therefore, mobile telephones are called cellular telephones or cell phones in North America. In addition to telephony, digital mobile phones support a variety of other services, such as text messaging, multimedia messaging, email, internet access. Short-range wireless communications, satellite access, business applications, video games and digital photography. Mobile phones offering only those capabilities are known as feature phones, mobile phones which offer greatly advanced computing capabilities are referred to as smartphones. The first handheld mobile phone was demonstrated by Martin Cooper of Motorola in New York City in 1973, using a handset weighing 2 kg. In 1979, Nippon Telegraph and Telephone launched the world's first cellular network in Japan. In 1983, the Dyna TAC-8000X was the first commercially available handheld mobile phone. From 1983 to 2014, worldwide mobile phone subscriptions grew to over 7 billion, enough to provide one for every person on Earth. In the first quarter of 2016, the top smartphone developers worldwide were Samsung, Apple and Huawei. Smartphone sales represented 78% of total mobile phone sales. For feature phones as of 2016, the top-selling brands were Samsung, Nokia and Alcatel. Mobile phones are considered an important human invention as it has been one of the most widely used and sold pieces of consumer technology. The growth in popularity has been rapid in some places, for example in the UK the total number of mobile phones overtook the number of houses in 1999. Today mobile phones are globally ubiquitous. And in almost half the world's countries, over 90% of the population own at least one. A handheld mobile radio telephone service was envisioned in the early stages of radio engineering. In 1917, Finnish inventor Eric Tigerstead filed a patent for a pocket-sized folding telephone with a very thin carbon microphone. Early predecessors of cellular phones included analog radio communications from ships and trains. The race to create truly portable telephone devices began after World War II, with developments taking place in many countries. The advances in mobile telephony have been traced in successive generations, starting with the early Xeroth generation services, such as Bell Systems Mobile Telephone Service and its successor, the Improved Mobile Telephone Service. These 0G systems were not cellular, supported few simultaneous calls, and were very expensive. Smartphones have a number of distinguishing features. The International Telecommunication Union measures those with internet connection, which it calls active mobile. Broadband subscriptions. In the developed world, smartphones have now overtaken the usage of earlier mobile systems. However, in the developing world, they account for around 50% of mobile telephony. Feature phone is a term typically used as a retronym to describe mobile phones which are limited in capabilities in contrast to a modern smartphone. Feature phones typically Provide voice calling and text messaging functionality, in addition to basic multimedia and internet capabilities, and other services offered by the user's wireless service. Provider A feature phone has additional functions over and above a basic mobile phone, which is only capable of voice calling and text messaging. Feature phones and basic Mobile phones tend to use a proprietary, 
custom designed software and user interface. By contrast, smartphones generally use a mobile operating system that often shares common traits across devices. The critical advantage that modern cellular networks have over predecessor systems is the concept of frequency reuse allowing many simultaneous telephone conversations in a given service area. This allows efficient use of the limited radio spectrum allocated to mobile services, and lets thousands of subscribers converse at the same time within a given geographic area. The world's largest individual mobile operator by number of subscribers is China Mobile, which has over 902 million mobile phone subscribers as of June 2018. Over 50 mobile operators have over 10 million subscribers each, and over 150 mobile operators had at least 1 million subscribers by the end of 2009. In 2014, there were more than 7 billion mobile phone subscribers worldwide, a number that is expected to keep growing. Mobile phones are used for a variety of purposes, such as keeping in touch with family members, for conducting business, and in order to have access to a telephone in the event of an emergency. Some people carry more than one mobile phone for different purposes, such as for business and personal use. Multiple SIM cards may be used to take advantage of the benefits of different calling plans. For example, a particular plan might provide for cheaper local calls, long-distance calls, international calls, or roaming. Subscribe this channel to get more informative videos.